Hey everyone, it's Shakira from GlowBeautyWellness.com and in today's video I have a keto friendly, high fat, low carb dessert recipe for you. So, real quick, I have decided to try the keto lifestyle and intermittent fasting lifestyle because I got some goals, okay? And as hard as I work out, um, as much as I, you know, live a healthy lifestyle or have lived a very healthy lifestyle, my body is just trying to hold on to some fat that it no longer needs. So we'll talk about that in a separate video, but I made this recipe up on the fly, on the fly, and I wanted to make sure I captured it for you. So we're using this coconut cream that I've had in my pantry, and I drained the liquid that was in the bottom. So you can blend this, and that's the goal is to make it smooth. You can put it in a blender, but anytime in you know the past that I've blended coconut cream, a lot of it has ended up in the blender, and I don't want that. Like I want all of my coconut cream in my uh, dish so that it can freeze and set up and be delicious. So I <laughs> tried the spatula, the fork, and now this whisk to make sure things are smooth, and this actually did it. For me next we're adding 15 drops of stevia which I used to hate but now that I've cut out you know sugar and sweets and stuff I need something so stevia has been here for me for the past week make sure you blend it well and you also want to make sure you give it a taste to make sure it is sweet enough for you next this coconut oil I just added it because I am all new to this and so every um you know any fat that I have around the house, I just wanted to make sure I added, except for ghee. So here we're adding cinnamon and I'd say about a teaspoon or half a teaspoon, depending on how spicy you like it. I love cinnamon, so I'm sure that was a little more than a teaspoon and a half. Next, I'm adding a pinch of matcha powder. I have an abundance of this stuff because my friend sent me some matcha and so if you don't like matcha you can totally omit this step but I like it in this recipe in my tea eh, not so much so I'm actually going to add a little more because I want the bars to be super green okay so the idea here is to just make sure you blend until smooth you will have a nice nice creamy um, texture if you use a blender but we just we doing this on the fly so you know work with me okay so the next thing that we're gonna do is going to take some type of pan or cupcake or uh, container whatever you're gonna use silicone uh, if you have it and you're gonna spray some coconut oil on the inside because we want to make sure nothing sticks then of course you pour your mixture into the container and you're put in the freezer for about 45 minutes to an hour until firm. So this is the um, pan after the freezer. Pretty hard to cut, but actually the center was a little, um, a little less firm. So, and it will be easier if you have a square or a rectangle pan that you set this up in or even silicone um, dishware that you know you can just pop the treats out of so I definitely did a hack job on these treats but they turned out so delicious so creamy and I think that if you are on the keto diet you will really really love this treat After you get it out of whatever you set it up in, feel free to dust some matcha powder over it, or you could also do cinnamon powder, whatever you like the most, and then enjoy. As always, I thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.